Hey America, Chef John the Ghetto Gourmet here cooking up a little Asian food tonight. We've got shrimp, um, uh, a little Hunan oil, ginger, garlic. Okay, we're going Asian. We got some rice right there. We got sugar. Um, these are uh, snap peas. In Asia, it's real interesting. They grow them real big, and then they take the 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 um, the the uh, here. I'll pop one open. And in here, see that right there? These things are so sweet. Mm. Oh, I love them. And in Asia, they um, in the in the big cities, you'll find that the the peas, or it used to be that they'd be empty. Well, they'd send us the pods, <laughs> and they'd keep all the sweet peas for themselves. So I'm gonna stand you. I'm gonna stand you. Do you guys stand me? I stand you. Um. Hope you like yesterday's show. That felt pretty good, you know. Um. So, okay, we, I'm, I'm a, a, we got white rice done. And I'm almost thinking of making like a combination, putting some um, iceberg with this. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna. I think I'm just gonna have the rice. Okay, I'm here. Let's move you closer. I've already turned the heat on seven. This is a cornstarch slurry, water, cornstarch. Um, I'm gonna, wanna see something cool? It's a bacon press. Is that awesome or what? I got that out yard sailing years ago and I was in my, my neighbor needed some stuff and uh, for his bike and I helped him, you know, and I got tools. I'm a real man, I got tools, you know what I mean? I'm gonna take about that much chicken stock, a little less. That much chicken stock because it's salty. Throw it right in with the cornstarch. Um, beat that up a little bit more with cold water. And uh, we'll move you up to the pan. All right. And I'm going to take uh, a little Hunan oil. And Oh, this is sesame oil, actually, with um, with the red peppers. I call it Hunan oil. I mean, I'm probably not being correct in that, so I might as well say that now. All right, and then I'm going to come over here. A little butter. And this is going to happen fast. So here's my shrimp. All right, old bay on the shrimp, as usual, just a little bit. Um... Uh, Ginger. Garlic. Woo, that was some garlic. <laughs> uh, hard veggies, right in with the shrimp right now. And spread these shrimp out a little bit. There we go. Hard veggies in there. And that's gonna include our celery, still from last month, kind of woody. Uh, sugar snap peas and uh, a little soy sauce on top paprika then we're going to go straight back in the oil get some hot stuff out I love hot food that's gonna be spicy right there and it's already starting to shrimp are already starting to cook through Shrimp are almost cooked through already. These are uh, these are 5160s. The other ones uh, at the uh, grocery cart, I couldn't. I bought them last week and they were 4150s. It doesn't say it on the bag, and I was trying to ask the guy, but I can tell from the difference in size because I've been with shrimp, uh, working with shrimp types 
for so long I can just recognize how big they are. All right, and um, then we're gonna take our chicken stock, cornstarch slurry. Boom. A little bit more water. A little bit more soy sauce. I got more soy sauce, you better believe it. And what I'm doing right now behind the scenes is I'm cutting a tomato into wedges. Bit more water to make a sauce there. Put a lot of cornstarch in there. That'll do. That'll do, rabbit. That'll do. But I wonder what that's from. That'll do, rabbit. <laughs> All right. Bing a ling a ling bang. It's done. See our shrimp are curling. Heat off. Set you on deck. Right. Fluff my rice. Put it on this side of the plate here. Rice is really meant traditionally to cool your palate. All right. And here's our shrimp and snap piece. And uh, I could have had a bigger plate, huh? <laughs> All right. And then we like that. And that messed up my deck. And you know I am about my deck. Funny about my deck. Same way in the kitchen, though. I'm in the kitchen. I'm, I'm like, I got to keep my deck clean. Got to keep my deck clean. And grab these tomatoes. Go right across the top of them. Okay. And I'm going to finish this off in an interesting way. Because I didn't put it right in the sauce. I always like a little sweet with the heat. So... I'm gonna shake a little sugar across it and then a little bit more soy sauce all right and make that sugar kind of fall into it sweetens the soy sauce up and um, that's our meal man Short, sweet, to the point. A little bit more Hunan oil and pepper. It kind of all went in one spot, didn't it? <laughs> oh my gosh, what am I doing to myself? Oh no! <laughs> it's Sunday. I hope everybody had a wonderful Sunday. You guys know that I'm a man of faith, but I don't care what faith you are or whether you are of faith. I hope that you, uh, uh, um, really, I hope that you just love yourself, man. And if you love yourself and you can love the brother, you're more or less just doing everything that every faith on this planet is. You know, um, I've been around a lot of faithless people lately. In my development and haters and you know I've talked about that. What a wonderful day at church today. 13 people in church today. <laughs> it was a good message. All right. Well, anyways, off of that and on to this. And then, just like they do in the restaurant. Look at my deck. It's a mess. That was quick, huh? Ten minutes. Chef John, to get a gourmet, let's zoom in. Shrimp, sugar snap peas, celery, white onion. 
and a, a garlic ginger sauce with uh, hot peppers over white rice. Chef John, get a gourmet. I want you to eat better in your own. I want you to have a better community. I hope you enjoy my show. Um, that was a cornstarch slurry, how we thicken this. All right. Peace.